Hi, this is Rita from Movie Spirit. In this lesson, we will introduce how to record your voice and how to edit your recording. Please pay attention to the red circle on the screen. The red circle you see on the screen is where my finger pushes on. We will take this project example here. Let's add a voice recording to this project. Tap on the plus button in the middle screen and then tap Add Voice. Then you can start recording your voice here. We would like to highlight one issue here. That's in case your video project already has the background audio and you want to insert your voice recording at the same time. In this case, to avoid any interference recording effect, it's better to turn on this background audio button here and then record your voice with the cell phone headset. And for this case, I don't need the background audio, so I just turn it off. To start recording your voice, tap on this red circle and it will start recording your voice. And re-tap on the red circle, the recording will be stopped. And you can pre-listening to the recording by tap on this button. Tap on this button, you can redo the recording. To complete the recording, just tap on this tick button. As you can see now, the voice recording has been inserted into the project. And it will go directly to the voice editing mode. All the voice editing features are listed in the middle of the screen here. I will introduce all the voice editing features one by one now. The first icon is the trash can icon. To delete the current editing voice records, just tap on this icon, the voice record will be deleted directly. The next feature we are going to introduce is about how to trim the voice record. Take the voice record I just insert as example here. I only need the middle part of the voice record. Then I can use this function to trim the voice record as I need. Draw the start timeline to the place from where you want to keep and then draw the end timeline to the end part also. You can adjust the voice volume as you need. You can also pre-listening to the record to see whether the trim has been performed correctly or not. If not, make the adjustment again. And at last, tap the deck to confirm the trimmed operation. The next feature is about how to split our record. In which situation we need to split our voice record? For example, you have a voice record in total 3 minutes. You only want to keep the first minute and the last minute. Need to delete the middle part. In this case, you can use this split function to split the middle part out and then delete it. Or in some case, you just want to split the voice record into two parts and use them separately. Then in such case, you can use this function to do it. Okay, let me demonstrate the specific operation steps. Firstly, draw the Y circle of the timeline to the field where you want to split the voice record. Double tap on the voice item to enter into the editing mode and then tap on the speak icon. As you can see, this voice record has been split into two parts now. Let's go to the next feature, motion point. We need to tap the plus button to add the motion point here. For music and voice record, the type of the motion point is only be used for the music volume adjustment. 
In some specific situation, you may want to turn up or turn down the voice volume. Then you can add the motion point here to make the change. Let me show you again. Draw the timeline to the field where you want to add the motion point, and then tap on the plus button to add it. And then adjust the voice volume as you need. At last, click down. As you can see, there in total two motion point has been added. You can have a try it by yourself and see the difference. To remove the motion point you just added, just need to double tap on the motion point number. The motion point will be deleted directly. Okay, let's go to the next feature: fade in, fade out. Just turn on this button. The fade in, fade out effect will be auto applied to the voice records. The next feature is voice volume. You can turn up or turn down the voice volume here. In case you adjust the volume to zero, the voice record will be mute here. The next feature is you can adjust the voice speed as you need. I slow down the speed here. Let's see the output. Hi, this is Rita from Movie Spirit. In case I speed up the speed, let's see the output. Hi, this is Rita from Movie Spirit. In this session, we'll introduce how to record your voice. Anyway, you can adjust the voice speed as you need here. The next feature is about how to duplicate a voice record. As you can see, I just tap on this duplicate icon. The voice record has been duplicated here. The last four icons are used to move up and down for all the chairs in the project. Okay, we have finished introducing all the voice editing functions we can make with our movie series. In case you want to learn more professional editing skills, please refer to our advanced course. Thank you.